Hello everybody, NinjaWex the Enlightened Gamer here. Welcome to the, I think, ninth, eighth or ninth series here on side. Number, correct number will be on screen, or at least in the intro. Today we're gonna start a new side Let's Play. Originally, this was going to be Roller Coaster Tycoon, but technical issues arise, arose, and instead, we're doing Mario Party 3. Interesting, since we haven't done a Mario game yet on side. At least I don't think so. No, I don't think we have. I'm going to go on ahead and restart this so I can go through the intro with you guys. Because unlike Mario Party 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8, Mario Party 3 actually has a pretty decent single player campaign. In the center of the vast universe, a remarkably bright star was born. It was a star that is born only once in a thousand years. The Millennium Star. However, since the Millennium Star was but a newborn, it fell from the starry sky. Around that time, Mario and his friends were all happily relaxing. When a star hit the planet and nothing happened. <laughs> Seriously. I mean, I'm not a scientist, but there should be more damage than that. Mario and his friends soon began arguing over who should keep the Millennium Star. Seeing this, Lakitu came flying in, dangling a toy box from his rod. That's right, we could play Mario Party to see who the biggest superstar was! Yay! Look at how excited Yoshi is! You might even say he's so happy! What? And with that bright, bright flash, Mario and his friends were transported inside the toy box. Greetings, I am the Millennium Star. You must pass my test to prove yourself worthy of possessing me. Follow me. Yay! Mario Party 3! Ha ha! Okay. You can see I've already erased all my old files, so everything should be new. We're gonna go on ahead and select this file here, file one, and name the file... Come on. Oh, good. Ninja! So what are we gonna do for this Let's Play? Well, much like Pokemon Stadium and Viva Pinata before it, this will be a bit of an elongated one. Each season will be a different character finishing the single player mode on a different difficulty setting. So it's gonna be fairly long Let's Play. But with that said, what are we going to do in terms of individual episodes? I'm going to try and upload roughly 45 minute episodes like I have been. And hopefully I can keep the energy high throughout because <laughs> it's Mario Party, you know, you know shenanigans are going to go down. So let's go on ahead and get it and head in. Story mode, let's begin our adventure. The game setup will take place before the story begins. Okay, we have six characters to choose from from the story. Mario, Luigi, Peach, Yoshi, Wario, and Donkey Kong. Who I normally play in Mario Party is either Donkey Kong or Wario. But, since this is going to be the easy mode playthrough, and since, well, technically many people have speculated the main character of this Mario Party is Luigi, Let's go with Luigi! 
Good choice. And I said we're gonna start on easy, then normal, then hard, then very hard. Oh, very hard's gonna be fun. Especially since I've never even done this game on hard all the way through. Let's -a go! And of course, for you guys, all mini games will be playable. We saw this. We saw this. I can't believe I goofed up. I messed up. Mistakes have been made. Blum, blum. Ba da da ba 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 da ba da ba da ba da ba ba da ba ba da ba ba da ba da ba da ba ba. See, look at how Luigi is the only one that doesn't start fighting over it. He's just captivated by it. Everybody else is arguing. Luigi's just chill because he's Luigi. Sound effects stolen from Mario 64. Yay! Suddenly, the Millennium Star gave off a brilliantly bright flash of light. Fun fact, when I was younger, I couldn't spell Millennium. And so I spelled it Malanime. <laughs> Blum, blum. Yep, we're transported inside the toy chest. This character is Tumble. He's still better than Toad. You already heard my greeting. Why are you listening to it again? I don't know why you're wasting my time. Oh wait, it's different. You must adventure across many lands and collect the star stamps. Wit, kindness, strength, love, courage, beauty, and I think the last one was, uh, mischief. If you collect all seven, I shall accept you as the top superstar in the universe. First, you must set forth to get the hit wit. Sorry, my uh, actual monitor I'm using to, I'm, I'm looking at is kind of not very good. The Wit Star Stamp. Which means we get the easy board first. I heard that. I gotta go tell the great Bowser. He's so great, he wins 0% of the time. Well, he won in two games when he was teamed up with Mario. Well, if you're ready, head to Chili Waters! Yep, as you can tell, this toy box is based off of Mario's Peach's Castle, I mean, from Mario 64. <coughs> you know what? I know the rules, but there's a chance somebody out there might have never played Mario Party before. Let's listen to the rules. Okay, and by that I mean I'm gonna explain them to you. Why did I do this? Why did I do this? Next up, Battle Royale Rule Map. Now, I'll explain the rules for the Battle Royale Map. Listen closely and remember what I say. Okay, let's start the explanation. I kind of wish that this was a playable map. I think that would have been a neat little bonus. We've arrived! This is the Battle Royale rule map! I bet you'd all like to hear how the Battle Royale rules work now. Wow, Tumble is way too happy on that backboard card. First, you hit to determine order. Highest goes first, lowest goes last. Mario goes first, then Peach, then Yoshi, then Wario. Yeah. Yeah. Ah! That's grating. 
And fourth is, of course, Wario, because, you know, we had to make Wario last. Let's start the game! Mario hits the dice, moves forward the number of dice, he gets a blue space that gives him five coin or three coins. But during the last five turns it's six coins. Peach gets a red space, she loses three coins, or six on the last five turns. Three, it's a happening space. Something will happen. Except that this time nothing happened. Oh boy, it's chance time. Something crazy is likely to happen, or nothing will happen, because it's chance time. At the end of each turn, all four players engage in a mini game based off of the spaces that they landed on. Bowser Space creates a Bowser event that can do lots of different stuff. Sometimes it's helpful, most of the time it's not. One, two, three, four, five. This is an item space. Play a game for an item. Or sometimes answer a question for up to three. Wow, Tumble, you are not as good at this as I am. Let's end this. I think we can figure out the rest as we go. I think I've wasted enough time. Let's start out our Chili Waters map. Let's see who our opponents are here. Welcome, Luigi! Battle Royale map round one is for the Wit Star stamp! You'll play on this map this round! Chilly Waters is a difficulty of one star with frosty snowmen and perky penguins! Yeah! Now let's meet the challengers! Mario, DK, and Peach. Let's confirm the rules. In story mode, the number of turns is set to 15. The bonus option is on, and handicap option is off. You've chosen to use all the mini games. Yeah! That's all there is to explain. Good luck, everyone! I'm ready. Chili Waters gimmick is that if two players stop on the ice, it'll crack and you'll be chased over to that pink spot over in the lower right. I've been waiting for you, Luigi. None of you others are worthy of my glow, I guess. Welcome to the legendary Chili Waters. In this snowy, freezing land, you'll battle to become the superstar against these other three inconsequential characters. And just as promised, if you win here, the Wit Star Stamp will be yours. Let's begin. We have to determine the turn order. Ooh, I go first! I mean, I kind of like to go in one of the middle spots, personally. But first is okay. Second is Mario. Third is DK. First gives you a slight edge when chasing stars. Fourth gives you a tactical edge in knowing what your opponents have already done. And being the last one to move means you can sabotage whoever's in first at the last second. Okay, let me show you where the first star is! Oh boy. Ah! Oh, this star ended up here! This is terrible! It's so easy to get to, but I'm dumb! Sorry. I'm gonna be doing that some. Ruigi, let's the start! Got a three? Really? Wow. An inauspicious beginning. If you pass 
the bank, you have to donate five, or deposit five coins. If you land on it, you get all the coins in the bank. I figure most of you guys probably already know this, but I just am gonna keep on going over it to be safe. One, two, three, four, five. So since I landed on red, they all landed on blue. It's one versus three. And since I deleted all the games, we won't know what game I'm playing until after we actually play it. This is hide and sneak. Oh lord. It's a luck-based game. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Let's go. No hesitation. Stop. Let's see where they're gonna go. Looks like they all headed to the rock first. And then to the bush. Let's try the bush. I should have gone with the... Um, stump. Three, two, one. I think they're gonna be behind the mushroom house. I got DK! One more to go if I can get Peach. It's a 50-50 shot. Then it's over. I'm gonna guess rock. Woo! Yay! Yay! I'm the best. You are, Ouija. You are the best. And that win catapults me into first. By just a little bit. Because this is early in the game and anything can happen. Let's go! Oh, one less than I would have got on the bank. Fantastic! I don't even care. I'm happy about that. Okay, now let's see what the monkey does. He gets a five, so he's going on the ice. Remember what I said. If two players or more stop on the ice, it cracks. And you have to be dumb. If this was in the last six turns, or five turns, Peach would have to duel me now. But she would declare the terms since she's the second one landing on the space. Duel mini games are one on one. Bowl the ball. And since 1v1 was kind of perfected in this version of Mario Party, it has probably the best duels in the series, in my opinion. Use the machine at the summit to roll boulders. I don't like this game. I don't like- at least we're on easy, so it shouldn't be too bad. Let's go! No hesitation. No hesitation. Let's not be dumb. Oh, I'm over on the right side? I much prefer the left for this game. No! I'm so close! No! Stop cheating! Somebody get to stop! Come on, Peach! Peach! Wow! Peach actually pulled through! No, he did. no she didn't. Look at how close that was! Look at how close! Aww! And Mario's in first now. Let's see if we can't turn this around. Well, it rolls like these, it's not likely. Okay, one, two, three. Let's see what happens here. Yeah, of course he has to pay because he didn't stop on the bank. Oh, the bonus stars. I guess I can talk about those. At the end of the game, if you have the most coins, you get a star. If you won the most mini games, you get an extra star. And if you landed on the most happening spaces, you get an extra star. Wow. There are two different shops, Baby Bowser and Toad. Toad gives you the items that help you. Baby Bowser gives you the items that hurt everyone else. I kind of prefer the Bowser shop. With the exception of the dual glove, which is my favorite item. Mainly because I really enjoy those dual games. Oh no!
think he's dumb. If he would have let himself get hit twice, he would have been very close to the star. But because he didn't, I'm still in the first. I'm still closest to the star, tied with Mario and coins. What's this game? Oh, frigid bridges. This is a rough one. I mean, we're on easy, so I have a shot, but... Let me sit up straight. I don't want to be leaning back for this one. I have to pull all three ice blocks to the end of the bridge so I can cross to the island. I used to be pro at this. Like, I could break... I, I could break every record ever made. No, I didn't want to go that way! Come on, Luigi. Come on, be a bro. No, I didn't slide off! Ice physics! You are the worst thing that was ever made, ever! Except for all those other things that are actually worse. Why did you slide? Why did you slide? Why did you turn? Why didn't you turn? Turn, Luigi! Really? We're doing this? We're doing this? Really? There we go, got the second one pretty good. Oh, dang it. Dang it. Oh, why am I so bad at this now? As soon as I'm on camera, I get all the bad mini games. <laughs> Give me a good game. Give me one that is actually good. And now Peach is temporarily in first. Not that that matters. Next mini game, DK is gonna win. I'm calling it. Ooh, I got a nine. I got the Bowser Jr. shop, but I only have 18 coins, and I don't want to burn them. Wow. Next turn, I get the star. Oh, what? 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 Oh. <laughs> Hidden blocks can be on any blue space on the map. They sometimes contain stars. They sometimes contain 10 coins. And I got a Sculpin Key. That is super depressing considering what that could have been. That is super depressing. I am like maximum depressed right now. Oh. Crap. Rare items, I don't remember what all of them do, but they all do something big if used right. Come on, snowman, get the monkey with the ball. I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter. All you have to do to clear the snowball is wait until the A is flashing on the HUD and then tap it. It's so easy. So... Whoa. No. No. Don't tell me. Please tell me she's not gonna get the star. Oh, good! Oh, 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 no, no! Oh, no! <laughs> Battle games! Everybody has to give coins to determine who wins. If, the, if I don't win, and they're almost all luck-based, then I don't get the star, and I have to take another pass. Ten coins, so I have to win this or the minigame. DK was skimpy. He didn't give out in all the coins. Okay, what are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Oh god. Oh god. It's not a luck based one, but it's one I'm bad at. I am bad at this. Okay. Here we go. This is my concern talking. I am concerned. No, 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 no! No, why did you spit me out? Don't 
be stupid! Oh! Why? Game! It actually would be easier if it was moving faster. Oh no. Oh no. I got pity coin at least. Oh, DK, you got left in the ringer. Okay, it's all, it's a free for all, so give me something good. Give me something good, please. Mario's Puzzle Party. I don't remember this one by name. Oh no. It gave me my absolute worst one. It's basically like a Tetris clone, sort of. Kind of like, it, it's a puzzle game. There we go. Come on, I'm doing not so good, actually. I'm not getting many points. Okay, come on. Come on. It's on easy, at least, so I have a chance. Whoa, that's not good. Come on. That's not good. Dang it! Peach, you monster! Peach! Why do you hate life and love and puppies? No! You're such a cheat! How did you even get that high of a score? <laughs> now Mario's probably gonna get it. No, I don't have enough coins to risk it. I don't have enough coins to risk it. Come on. Let's get to the next mini game so Peach can win it because cheat. Really, you're gonna steal my skeleton key, Mario? Well, I hope you enjoy my skeleton key, Mario. You monster. Dang it! Mario's gonna get the star. Cause I can't get a break. Oh no he's not. He's just gonna get an item game. Or a uh, red space. Oh boy, this is a uh, game guy. Normally he'd take you off for a game by game guy game where you risk all of your coins for huge potential returns. Mario and DK versus me and Peach. Well, at least I'm probably gonna win. Oh, it's Eats a Pizza! This is probably my favorite one! Oh, uh, one of my favorites. I love Eats a Pizza. And it's a button masher, which is weird because I normally can't stand those. Just, all you do is move around and eat. Okay, let's, um, let's go! Toppings are harder to get through, so I normally like to go for them first. Come on, Luigi. Come on, Peach, help! Finish. Wow, I think we won. I'm pretty confident we won. Ah. Huh. It's amazing what team being teamed up with Peach does. 
Okay. She definitely has the most coins, but now I have enough for the star. So I'm okay with this. Three. What? Up, 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 Mario Party. Mario Party. Mario Party. Mario Party. Mario Party. M Mario Party. Mario Party. I'm sorry, I have no other words than that right now, because that is what happened. I guess we could hope for communism. Oh, wait, no. Oh, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm in last. I'm in last because of that stupid hidden block. And of course, his contained a star and mine contained a skeleton key, which he stole. That's Mario Party for you, though. If it, if it isn't for bad luck, you'd have no luck at all. She's gonna steal my star. That's why she did that. I'm not dumb. I'm on to your game, Princess Toadstool. Ooh, title toss! I actually like to be the one on the boat in this one, but... It's on easy, so I should be able to win. All you do is jump over the wave. and I helped Peach cement her coin lead. She's gonna steal my star. And it's gonna make me so sad. But I still have to go for the star. Because now I'm not in... Now I'm in second. So if the game's fair, she'd steal from Mario. I'm a got it indeed, but soon I'm a lose it because I'm familiar with the way this game works, and it works like a very evil, evil machine. Very, very evil machine. What was I just saying? Please tell me you can't. He, he, he could, but he didn't. He could have bought Boo Repellent and made it so Peach would be almost guaranteed to steal from me. But, well, easy level AI. Oh, DK, you were so close to getting all of that dough in the bank. And she's gonna steal this turn. Oh wait, no she's not. Why didn't you go to the boo, Peach? Are you just hoarding your coins? I think it's me versus everybody. It's crazy cogs. It's crazy cogs. This one's pure luck. But it's easy level AI, so I should be able to win. Yep. All I can do is spin the cog from my podium here. Go down! Go down! Finish. 
Go down! Dang it, Pete! You cheater! You're the cheater! I really don't like facing Peach in these games. Her AI is so broken. And now she has 800 trillion coins and I have negative eight. And she's not gonna steal because Mar because I didn't take the lead from Mario. Six, five, four, three. Oh, Bowser Shop. Let's see. That's all my coins. I don't want to buy that. A boo bell allows you to call the King Boo and to steal coins from somebody else. Or stars. I wasn't going to buy it if I uh, couldn't afford the star. Wow, you're throwing away my skeleton key. Salt in the wound. You butt. I swear, it really doesn't matter what difficulty you play this game on. It's completely random whether or not you do good or not. Come on! Everybody, let's not be dumb. Wow, that's dumb. The magic lamp allows you to essentially skip to a star. The smart thing to do is to save it until the last turn. But DK's not going to do that. He's going to grab the star that me and Mario are headed towards. And, or, and then next turn, Peach is going to take that star. Wow. How dumb. I mean, soon we'll all have stars. Mario didn't deserve his, but we'll soon all have stars. So, at least there's that, but... Still! Oh, Mario versus all of us. Of course I can't win if Peach isn't also winning. Okay, come on. Stop. Come on, guys, let's go. I can't believe I'm not going to get the coin star, or the minigame star. I might have lost. Dang it. I keep on looking away. Wasn't that a tie? Well, I guess it was a photo finish. It's because I screwed up so many times. Come on. Give me a break, game. Who cares? It doesn't matter anyways. DK's gonna swoop in and steal that. Mario's got the star. Mario's got the star! Are you guys ready to see some dumb AI in Mario Party? Because now DK's gonna take the next star with that lamp. And then Peach is gonna take the next star after that. And then I have to just hope that the star appears where I am. Come on, DK, do it. I know you're gonna do it. Good, you did it. Now he's gonna steal that star. Mushroom Cadabra indeed. Allow the cheatening to begin. Now I'm gonna go from second to last. And there's nothing that I could have done other than winning more mini games, most of which were luck based, to prevent it.
that star. Well, Peach is gonna be right next to DK, because that's where she's gonna go to get the star. Ooh, Bowser. I could actually go for some communism right now. Oh, I guess we're all going backwards this turn. So I hope the star appears very short behind me. Because then I'm going to crack at getting another star. And you're going to use your lamp. Because of course you are. Come on, let's go, Peach. Mushroom Kadabra again. Wow, this has been dumb. But I kind of, you kind of know it's going to be dumb when you go into Mario Party, so you don't really get mad at the dumb. You just accept it's going to be dumb ahead of time. We have a new leader, and her name is Princess Cheats. Oh, wait, no, Mario has two stars. Oh boy. Come on! The rolls! The rolls! Oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. That had the capacity to be incredibly dumb. Oh, it's ridiculous relay. I don't know, but do I have, which one do I have? Because as long as I don't have the middle one, we should be good. Looks like I have the first one. Oh, yeah, I definitely have the first one. This is a really easy one for me. But I'm not going to be able to talk much because it's a button mashing thing. Come on, Ouija! We can do this together if we just believe! Oh, my fingers are getting tired! That's not a good sign! Come on, Peach! You know you cheat to win all the minigames anyway, so you might as well cheat to help us win this one. Come on! I mean, I can just watch this now. I don't even... Oh, DK looks like he's gonna win. I doubt Mario can catch him. Come on, Mario, you got the simplest one of all. Just hit A. Just hit A a bunch of times, really fast. Make up for my lack of experience, my lack of, uh... Woo! You can see the ending. <laughs> it would have been so much better if DK wouldn't have got off the glider and just would have been like, I don't care anymore. Wow, Peach has 76 coins. I need to roll a big number. I don't know if that's big enough. Let's check out the map or the board. Yeah, the star's right there. How many more spaces do I got? Three. Let me see, that's one, two, three. That should be enough. I might be getting the next star after all. But you guys will see that next time. Until then, as always, please remember to stay enlightened.